Alrighty folks, real quick, back out with my honey hole. I found a wedding ring, class ring, a bunch of jewelry. I was just out here this morning, found some relics. Actually some big coins I missed too. But it's starting to rain, so I'm all the way back at my car way up there in the hill. I just started swinging, I think I found a surface fine here. Right, some chain there, something, it says something on there. Let's see what it says. <coughs> I'm assuming it was lost recently. Yeah, the clasp is on there, it looks like. But it looks like it broke. Rough housing around or something. Uh, it says wealth. Alrighty. Wealth. Piece of bling, I'm assuming. But I'll check that when I get home, just to make sure. Looks like it's staining up, though. Alrighty, I'll show you the wrap-up when I get home. It's starting to rain. Later. Alrighty, not a bad hunt here at my honey hole where I took my daughter's sled riding earlier this year. I'll get home, I'll do the wrap up. See you there. Hey folks, real quick wrap up. Found this thing I thought was interesting. I don't know if it's, uh, I think it's wrought iron. I might do some electrolysis on it. Thought that was pretty cool. Who remembers Finest? That was the name of the grocery stores before they became uh, Tri Town. A couple pencil ends, you know, pull tabs. Some coins that I missed, of course. And these are all six inches, they're down or more. I got three single quarters and then two two quarter holes. There's two quarters in each one of those holes. Four dimes, two nickels, two zincons, and a copper. Found that necklace that says wealth. I hope that's a sign of things to come. That'd be cool. And then I found this. I remember burying it about two years ago. I don't know what's inside. I'll open it up real quick. Could be a silver dollar, could be a copper round. We'll find out in a minute. Hold on. Alrighty folks, it is a Walk on Liberty Copper Round. Trying to get a little corrosion on it there. But yeah, I buried that in the ground, right where I found the class ring. I buried it about a year after I found the class ring. August 27, 2017. And I, uh, a month after I buried it, I found that guy's wedding band and was able to return it to him. So that was pretty cool. Doug, this has been on the ground for two years. Alrighty, I'll get that uh, polished up. We'll be giving it away in one of my giveaways. Stay tuned. Thanks for tuning in. Happy Easter. Hope everyone has a good day and weekend. Catch you later.